or we're in this guy now. And we're gonna go ahead and show you how you can remotely remediate the VPro system. The scenario is this, he's on his plane, uh, needs some assistance with his laptop that's not working correctly, reaches out to me. Uh, I connect up using Intel vPro and Intel vPro fleet services. Again, he's got a network connection, so it doesn't matter that he's in the air. All right, you can see there that Dan has promoted into the system. And I'm gonna give him the user consent code. Okay, I've gotten user consent code from the Dean. I'm gonna go ahead and enter it now into my system. Now that I've typed that in, I've got a connection to his system here remotely while he's on the plane. I've connected his system out of band with Intel AMT. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is uh, step through some diagnostics on his system. I'll give it a moment here to reboot. So this could be a scenario where he's experiencing some strange issues with Windows and has a very important presentation to give. Okay, we can see here that Windows is booted into diagnostic mode. I can come in and perform troubleshooting tasks, uh, back out patches, uh, if I need to uh, perform any number of tasks to get the system back up and running, uh, including even doing a factory image restore if I wanted to. Uh, but in this case, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, bring up a command prompt for an example. So in this case, type a little fix it in just to give you an example of things I could have done. Now that I've fixed the problem, I'm going to exit out of here. And I'm going to continue back into Windows. All right, and then we're back into the OS. So Dan was able to remotely connect to the system while we're in the sky, establish a KVM session, reboot the machine, back into recovery mode, uh, troubleshoot, remediate, and reboot the system, all while sitting on a plate 